Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me here today in The Walking Dead, The Game. If you haven't checked out any of the previous episodes, I highly recommend going back and checking them out because things are getting real here with Lee, Clementine, and the rest of the gang. Uh, we just escaped the pharmacy. Lee saved Carly, uh, and now we're all here and probably settling in for a little bit, it looks like. So we're going to take a few seconds, walk around, talk to everyone. Uh, maybe not this jerk over here, uh, but let's talk to Glenn and Katya, Kenny, Duck, Clem, and see what everyone has to say. Um, Carly's over there. Okay, so we'll we'll start with Glenn here. I think I need to go. To Atlanta. Yeah, I got friends there. Hmm. I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. So that's how Glenn's going to get into the TV series. I got to take my chances. Okay, we understand. I think that's right. You gotta do what you gotta do. Find your friends. Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. <laughs> don't think about that, Glenn. That's the past. Gotta let it go, man. I don't know if you guys saw the uh, the bumper sticker on that truck there, but uh, sums up the whole situation they're currently going through. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today... I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. <laughs> Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Okay. So let's go talk to... Let's go talk to Carly here, I think. Yeah, that's what it's pushing us towards. Let's go talk to Carly. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering... I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Hmm. <laughs> sure he liked you too. I'm sorry, Carl. You'll be alright. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. A little space, a little Wait. time. Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We Oof. both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Okay, Carly asking the hard-hitting questions. Let's go talk to the kids, see what they have to say. Yeah, you just stand over there and pout. Toast, but you know what? You jerk. He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, duck. Uh, you want to cool it for a minute? <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm sorry. There's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Aww. One had the other one. It's just a walkie-talkie, so it can't help us. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll get that patched Thanks. up for you. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. <laughs> and now 
they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Mm. Let me go deal with this. <laughs> oh man, Clementine, another thing. <laughs> what do you want? You like my daughter? Uh, her dad tried to kill me. Her dad tried to kill me, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Didn't I get all that medicine for you, my man? Hey, and you're going to be an ass about it? Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. At least someone recognizes Dad that. Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. <laughs> I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me National too. Guard getting into action. It's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. <laughs> Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Ah, you just jinxed it. You just jinxed it, Lily. As oh, there goes the power. To be continued, is that the end of the episode? Wow. All right, the next time on The Walking Dead. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. <laughs> I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. <laughs> an arrow? We're going back. Well, that guy just took an arrow in the back. Jeez. Episode 2, Starve for Help. Alright, well I'm excited for us to, to check that out. Well, I guess this will be a short episode. We're only at like 8 minutes. Um, let's see. Ooh, we got a breakdown of everything we've done. Okay, honesty. Lied to Herschel. You and 63% of people were honest. Okay. Uh, forty. Okay, about split on Duck versus Sean. Loyalty to Kenny. You and 48% of players defended, players defended Kenny. Uh, Mercy. Gave Irene the gun. Okay, about half of us refused to give her the gun. Uh, and then 76% of players chose to save Carly. Well, probably because this is mostly men or boys playing this game. And, of course, they're going to save the woman. Uh, so let's go ahead and click to continue, see if there's anything else we get to see. Or is it going to pop us into the next episode? No, we're going to get the credits for the first episode. Well, I think that's a fantastic place to stop. I know this episode's short, but um, I think we'll try and break this down uh, into their episodes as well too. So thank you so much for coming out and watching this video If you've enjoyed this content, don't forget to like and subscribe uh, Subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in orderly fashion Don't forget to like the video and then as always leave me a comment on down below what you think's happening uh, What's going on? What do you think is gonna happen in the next episode that teaser it, it showed us quite a bit So I'd love to hear from you guys uh, Otherwise if not, I'll let the credits roll and then I'll see you guys in the next episode